Ekaterina wants to know, what role does internal culture play in the company's success? Can you give one concrete tip on building that culture? Ekaterina, how are you doing? It's always great to hear from you. I'm glad you're on the show. Uh, <laughs> company culture is actually the only, you know it's funny, it's funny this question's coming up today. I actually, on the way to work today, said, you know what, the book that I'm gonna write that's really gonna like, you know, I always think is crush it. Oh, thank you, economy's gonna sneak up on people. I know, as I sit here today, the book that I write on culture and how to build an organization through humans, not CFO cash tactics, is gonna be my book legacy, so whenever I get to that. Uh, so it's everything to me. As an operator, I'm all EQ over IQ. The one concrete tactic I have is way too many people make decisions on who they fire or hire based on money. Oh, we have the budget to hire another designer or camera person or like, it's, it's a financial decision. All my decisions on hiring and firing are emotional. What is it gonna do to the collective community? You know, um, if I fire this person who's so popular internally because they have great people skills, will that hurt everybody else and can I, can I push that person in, into another direction to help them get another job over 90 days instead of firing them abruptly in one day? That costs me a lot more money but does a hell of a lot for me in the culture. And so um, that is my one concrete l- kind of curveball. Haven't heard a lot of people talk about that kind of stuff. Example.